Hello my friends, thank you so so much for tuning in and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Jen and I love all things color. Today we are talking about makeup, color makeup. I haven't done that in a while guys. I've just been, just gone down the sunscreen rabbit hole, just been buying and well, you know what I mean? I, I, I don't want to blame myself. There have been so many exciting new sunscreens that have been launched and I've just been trying sunscreen after sunscreen after sunscreen. In fact, I just got done finished with a sunscreen video i hopefully it's uh it's up before this one so anyways uh we are talking about a liquid blush by laura mercier so this is a brand new launch i think it is a brand new launch it's a tinted moisturizer blush so and it uh it retails for 30 plus dollars laura, Mer laura mercier's products are a little bit on the expensive side but what really caught the my eye is moisturizer blush so i wanted, wanted to quickly take a look at the ingredients list i was kind of impressed i'm not gonna lie i was quite impressed the first in like we have so many moisturizing ingredients first ingredients water a lot of products do have that and then i think the third fourth ingredient there's glycerine and then there's raspberry seed oil and then I see squalane, I see uh, aloe vera extract, I see, I'm not sure what this is, indica fruit extract, then coralina extract, I'm not sure what that is, then there's turmeric root extract, then there's some kind of melia, is he, tough leaf extract, uh, what else, uh, there's the same melia, azicta flower extract, and there's a lot of botanical names, guys. I don't know what it is. And then basil flower extract, leaf extract, and then eggplant fruit extract, and moringa seed oil. I'm just like reading names of here and there. There are a lot more. I kind of left out three or four fruit or leaf or flower extract. I'm not sure. They're all botanical names. So it's a little hard for me to read all of them. But I was quite impressed by the list of ingredients because there were so many like natural beauty. It sounds very, very, very rich in ingredients. So I really wanted to give it a try. <laughs> I do have that on my cheeks right now. No highlighter, just the product. I do have like make makeup underneath. I have sunscreen and I set it with powder. And yeah. So let's get started. We quickly want to do like a swatch and then you'd see the demo section very quickly and also my final thoughts on the product so uh let, let me quickly tell you where this is made made in usa so 30 dollars plus i'm not sure 35 or something like that there are i believe six or seven shades in total or maybe even eight shades they have a good shade range i saw a lot of like light colors medium light medium and also medium tone colors i went I've been recently obsessed with this particular color, something similar to what I'm wearing. Uh, this shade, Cinnamon Flush. Oh wait, Spiced Cinnamon from Color Effects. And I don't see this color often, guys. Not very often. It's, sometimes it's very orange or it's red or this deep berry. But this particular color is like the best shade for me personally. I do like that watermelon -y, bright, happy color, but this one is like truly my color. So I saw this particular shade, or at least I thought uh, it's it's like a dark coral. This is in the shade, I got it in the shade um, Sun Drenched. So it is it, it was described as like a darker coral, and I was like, I do not have a lot of... Uh, cheek products in this color i just have that one spiced cinnamon from cover effect so i thought i'd go ahead and get it so 30 plus something i'm not sure how much and uh, you get 15 milliliters that's 0.5 fluid ounce of product and made in usa and it comes like a very easy like a squeeze tube and what else does it say dab a dot or two along the apples of the cheeks then blend it out for a healthy wash of colors so i did do this demo with my fingers i didn't use any brush so let's see so just basic or your regular tube so i'm just going to put a little bit oh i still don't feel okay now i got it finally just a tiny it's not even a pea size it's like a fifth 
of a pea size i don't know like very 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 little or, or even like a tenth i would say it's a tenth of a pea size so i'm just gonna do this it's like really pigmented but still look at that that tiny what gave us uh, such a flushed look i'm just like kind of spreading it around to show you what kind of flushed look you are look at that this is kind of the look what i have going on here and here i kind of put more on this cheeks and like i think on this side i put the the perfect amount just like my truly i'm blushing kind of a look on this cheeks and this cheek is a little bit on the excess but yeah that's what you're gonna get and uh, usually a lot of times a liquid blush would have like a finish like a glowy finish but this does not this is actually a matte finish i would say i don't have any highlighter on and uh yeah i think this is this glow you see is just like your regular my my you know the oils from my face is kind of giving the glow but otherwise it's just like a complete matte finish and it i'm just kind of like rubbing it back and forth to show you Kind of like the lasting power it doesn't exactly come off to be honest it kind of sets and the staying power is actually quite good it's actually quite good so yeah that's what you have so yeah let's get into the demo section you'd see how versatile and how incredibly easy it blended out without any streaks and just beautiful so you can kind of tell but the way i'm describing the product that i'm really really in love with the product so anyways let's just get into the demo and then you'll hear my final okay, thoughts guys, let's see what this looks like on the face uh, i quickly want to do a little demo all right so i'm just gonna take a little bit on this on my fingertip come on okay just a little bit and also on this fingertip too and I just want to quickly dab, dab that. And you can also smooth it. Even when you like kind of like drag it instead of that uh, patting motion, the dragging also works really. And look at that, it actually creates like a very smooth kind of blending. It's not patchy at all. It's actually quite good. So that's that on one side gonna do the same thing just the tiniest bit just that that's it because i'm using two fingers i don't need much so that's all i'm gonna put i really like how like smooth it is and not patchy at all the swatch really is smooth on the skin and at the same time oh, i think i put a little bit more on this side so yeah and this looks very, very natural. This is like my favorite, favorite shade of, like one of my favorite, my, I, I also do like the watermelony red shade, but this is actually my absolute favorite shade for blush. It's just like, I love it, guys. I really like how smooth and absolutely like so well formulated and it's not very shiny i'm not gonna lie it's not like a, like a, a cream blush where it gives like an ultra glow nothing like that as the name suggests it's like a moisturizer for the cheeks it just gives like a well moisturized but zero shine i don't see there's any, i don't think there's any shine so that's kind of like what this looks like overall i like the product i do like it it is kind of on the expensive side but liquid blushes uh, i cannot think of anything that's as fantastic as this you do have some of those um multi-purpose liquid uh pigments like like uh what danessa myricks has you know those can be used on the eyes cheeks lips those are there but they are more pigmented and you'll have to like use a brush because because they are like a multi-purpose so they the consistency is even more kind of darker and more pigmented almost like opaque to to some point but this is like really really very lightweight guys it's something that uh, you could just definitely throw it on your purse and just like apply it as you're going on the go and even without zero um you know makeup it's gonna look beautiful i really love like how like smooth that dispersion of product was on the skin 
it's not patchy at all it really looks like i'm like my skin is actually flushed evenly flushed even, that too you know it's not like uneven kind of or maybe it's the fact that the formula is fantastic and this color especially is so most so beautifully flattering on darker skin tones that i'm just like <laughs> i'm really 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 enjoying the product i love it i really do will i buy other colors i think the formula is good but i don't think i need other colors i really like this particular shade for my skin tone and because of how like on the go it is and this looks like my skin is naturally flushed or maybe really matches what i'm wearing and the eyeshadow and everything i'm just really loving it so yeah that's kind of like my final thoughts two thumbs up for the product i love how effortless oh and obviously i do have like makeup on this is like with makeup on i do have some sunscreen and i set my face with powder so i do have makeup on so this is over makeup and without uh as you guys saw i just used my fingertips so yeah two thumbs up i really like the product what do you guys think are you interested in getting it whatever it is i would love to hear come say hello in the comment section down below and i will see you guys very soon bye, -bye.